we forgot to bring all of them. We do have them, but we were like two hours away from the house and we realized we forgot them. You got a website? We do. If you go to stetsonandsia.com, okay. we have all of them online. And pretty much if you order it, I get the order and I send it out to you. So, so that's the way that goes. But I'll play part of this if you guys want to demonstrate just a slightly different style of play. It's nice I've up there. Tried just how do you make a banjo sound pretty? And exactly. then I remember thinking, well, guitar people do it all the time, so maybe you can take that same concept. And it's not all the rolls. I did that four string, four string roll in the beginning, but then this stuff, I just was, I kind of wanted it to sound like a harpsichord type of thing. Some of that is like where you're sliding behind yourself too. I think too, it just I, I when I heard that song, I thought it was really good because the, the banjo almost kind of offers a almost a very melancholic kind of depressed sound, but the lyrics aren't so that much because uh -huh. the guitar would have been way too sweet, I think, for that song. Yeah, it still keeps the banjo allows it to keep that sad tone to it. Yeah, there's um, just a, a very I'm not sure what word to place it. It's just it's almost a haunting tone. Um, it is haunting. And it's, I don't know, and I think when I wrote it, this was singing, it was kind of neat because when I wrote it, I was in a dressing room that was all concrete walls. Oh, and that so would make it sound I had great. that natural reverberation, and I thought, oh, wow, that might be it. So when I recorded it, Added. I tried to capture that. There's even a part in it where, um, where I'm singing, where I do just a little tag thing where I go and pick the banjo up, and I sing into the mic, into my banjo. Wow. Yeah. Right, to get that echo. Wow. You know, the tone that you get out of it is right. different. Have any of you guys ever seen um, the National Nashville, National Bluegrass Band? National Bluegrass Band? Absolutely. There's a clip where Alan O'Brien would, sometimes he was singing, pick that banjo up and sing to it because you could hear it bouncing back. There was one that was, The Father I stretch my hand to thee. You know, so it kind of adds some natural reverberation. It's kind of cool. Cool thing. Oh yeah, play with yeah. his nose. <laughs> yeah, that that didn't work so well, especially if you have a runny nose. Or just, uh, <laughs> a song that's in the movie Dumbo. Yeah, baby mine. That is such a beautiful song. I've heard Whitney sing it. I've never seen Dumbo. You know who does a really pretty version is Allison Cross. Yes. They did that Disney CD a while back, and it. Dumbo. How do you make Dumbo beautiful? Add Alison Krauss. Yeah, pretty much. Add Alison Krauss to anything is going to sound like angels or singers. So. 